Hey, V Team, happy Monday. I hope you all enjoyed your weekends. We had so many newsworthy events across the business last week that I thought I'd share. Starting with our 18th consecutive win for overall network performance by Root Metrics, the nation's most rigorous drive testing firm. Now, no, that's more than any other carrier in the report's history, so that's a pretty big win. And the work doesn't stop to remain America's most reliable 5G network. Verizon has started deploying 100 megahertz of C-band spectrum in many markets across the U.S., a significant increase from the 60 megahertz of spectrum already deployed. Now, by almost doubling spectrum in these areas, we now offer significantly higher speeds, much greater capacity to accommodate more customers, better performance, and the ability to offer 5G home broadband and business internet services to more customers. And on to some business news, the strength of our network is being relied on by some of our nation's biggest agencies like the FBI, who recently awarded Verizon a $400 million modernization contract to modernize and expand the Bureau's network infrastructure, data, and voice solutions. And Virginia, my hometown, International Terminals announced an agreement to build a private 5G ultra-wideband network at one of the Port of Virginia's main container terminals. Plus, Verizon Business announced the direct-to-consumer availability of the Sum Up Plus card reader to new and existing Verizon small and mid-sized business customers. So as you can see, we've had a lot of great network and partnership wins, but that's not the only news from the week. We also announced that the affordable Pixel 6a is coming to Verizon on July 28th. And we've got some great offers so you can easily get your hands on one. And while you're at it, download Verizon's CareSmart app on your phone. Verizon is making caregiving easier with Get Help Caregiver Alert, a new service available through Verizon's CareSmart app. And of course, on Friday, we announced our second quarter results with our leaders. If you haven't already watched the webcast, make sure you do that. Check out the replay link in our story. Whew, okay, that was a big week, and to just think we're getting started with this one. Coming up, we've got National Intern Day on July 28th, and we want to give a big shout out to the nearly 400 V-turns who have joined us for the summer. Let's hear from them on what they've been up to as they learn more about our business. One of my favorite things about being a Verizon intern is that I get to meet new and amazing people from all over the company every single day. My favorite part about this Verizon internship experience has definitely been the people. I've met so many great people, incredibly nice, incredibly smart. I've learned so much and everyone's so giving over their time. Um, it's just an amazing culture to be a part of. My favorite part about being an intern at Verizon is working on projects that I can actually see make a difference within the company. It's been so cool to be an intern and to know that I have an impact on a huge company like Verizon. My favorite part about being a V-turn is definitely how the VPs, directors, and managers are all super supportive, accessible, and very knowledgeable about the company. The one thing I love about Verizon internship is that they actually give you real projects that the full-time employees work on, and you can feel the impact to the team and to the business. My favorite part of being a VTR in the summer were the human connections that I had the opportunity of making, both within my team and outside of my team. They sculpted this summer to be a very exciting and enriching experience for me. So throughout my time as a VTR in the summer, I've had the opportunity to have my hands in a bunch of different projects. And I think that the coolest thing that I've seen so far is just how connected the employees are. They always have answers to my questions and they're always willing to help me derive solutions to help move the business forward. My favorite part of interning at Verizon so far has been how amazingly welcoming and encouraging everybody that I've met has been. Every single person I've talked to has asked me to reach out with any questions that I may have and have been willing to give me five minutes of their day to give me some advice on my own career. Each person that I've met has been super kind, supportive, and encouraging to me along this journey. Specifically with my team, I have been surrounded by team members who are not only concerned with what I can bring for Verizon, but also how they can help me grow and explore my career and my interests. Well, it looks like our V-turns are enjoying their summers, but whether you like it or not, it's almost that time of year again where backpacks and school supplies are filling the shelves. And here at Verizon, parents, students, and teachers can benefit from our affordable deals by getting up to $800 to put toward a new 5G phone with select trade-in and select 5G unlimited plans. Plus, get an additional $200 when you switch and save up to 50% on accessories perfect for the school year like wireless chargers, tablet cases, and more. 
And even more, teachers and college students can save up to $25 a month on all our 5G unlimited plans and get Verizon Home Internet starting at just $19.99 a month with autoplay plus taxes and fees. Now, this isn't a school uniform, but did you hear that our retail reps are now rocking a new look with new uniforms? It's so exciting to see, and it sounds like Coleman Montgomery from our Charlotte, North Carolina store is excited too. Let's take a look. What's up, V-teamers? My name is Coleman, and I'm here, a retail specialist here in Charlotte, North Carolina, and we just got our brand new blade collar polos, and they actually look really, really good. Got the Verizon check there, and they feel really good too. We've already had some customers complimenting them, and yeah, I love them. I'm ready to start this new chapter in our attire journey. Looking good, Coleman. And before I go, make sure you check out the Disability Pride Month Fireside Chat with Advanced Executive Sponsor and Chief Communications Officer, Jim Gerace, and Senior Vice President of Talent and Diversity, Christina Schelling, who will be part of the discussion focused on the future for the disability and inclusion space. Well, there's more up to speed all week long, so make sure you tune in. Let's make this week a great one. Until next time, you're up to speed.